I'm Judith Jones, food and travel editor of the Gourmet Travelista, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make flash cooked kale with red wine vinegar. So, we're going to start with four cups of Dino kale, and um, you can also use curly kale, which has been washed, de stemmed, and cut. Now, with those stems, I've cut them finely into small little quarter inch pieces. We're going to have two tablespoons of olive oil two large tablespoons of red wine vinegar, and salt and pepper to taste. So first things first, we're going to heat up our non-stick pan with our olive oil. Swivel that round a little. Now, we are first going to add our um, kale stems. These are much tougher than the leaves, of course, so these need to be cooked first for about three to five minutes. So we're just gonna put them in there. So we're gonna let those stems get a little softer and brown a little. So a lot of people don't like cooking with the stems because they are much tougher and they're quite bitter. But the stems contain a lot of good nutrients, minerals, and vitamins. So I like cooking with them. And plus, when you saute them, they get nice and soft and brown, which I don't mind at all. All right, so that has started to cook up nicely. So now we will add, so add the kale to the mix. Be careful for that hot oil spitting. And we're just gonna, mix it all around. So we're going to cook that just for another few minutes until the kale begins to wilt and maybe get slightly brown if you like it like that. So as it's cooking you can see that beautiful green color of the kale popping out and a lot of people like to flash cook and saute the kale like this because they like to present that kale nice and colorful and green because obviously when you braise it or when you um, boil it for a long time it loses the color and also loses the nutrients so that is just about done and before our next step we're gonna take off the heat so we've taken our um, flash cooked kale off the heat, let it cool ever so slightly, and we're gonna add in our red wine vinegar. Now this gives a lovely acidic taste and neutralizes that bitter kale. Fantastic. We'll stir that into the vinegar. And a little bit of salt and pepper to your liking. Not too much, as the red wine vinegar has a nice flavor to it. Stir all that in together, and that is so quick, simple, and easy, and we'll just plate that up. Mmm, smells delicious. Let the juice slow on it a little. And that's your flash cooked kale with red wine vinegar. Well, thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to check out some of our other fabulous videos and be sure to subscribe to us. And if you have any questions or queries, you can email us at requests at mahalo.com. Thanks again.